Gang, it's your girl that you know I'm back with another freaking video. Happy Sunday, y'all. Today your girl is going back to church. I'm not missing church. My goal is to make the church every Sunday. Every Sunday. If I don't, it's a reason why. But my goal is to make the church. I enjoyed church last week, so I'm going back today. Um, it's currently 9:35. Church started at 10. It's only three minutes away from my house. But I got dressed early, did my makeup. Y'all, last night I did my hair. I just got it pinned up right now because I don't want to go into church being all ghetto because, y'all, my hair is 36 inches. It is past my butt, and that's a lot. So I was like, let me just pin it up. That like somebody pin it up. But my hair came out real cute. I probably insert a picture of what my hair looked like down to show y'all. But my goal is to keep this in for two weeks. Um, I need to wear this to the, um, no, it's not really two weeks. Well, it's gonna be a week because once I go to the concert and come back, we gotta get a new style in my head. I got to get a new style in my head. Okay, so this week at church, y'all, they doing you ask for it, continues water baptism and graduation recognition. I can't even pronounce the word right. Acknowledgement. All right, we're gonna say this. So I don't know how long church gonna last. So hopefully we go over the bread first before this. Cause I probably leave got regular church we end at like eleven something eleven thirty. But if they doing all this extra stuff at the end, they probably gonna be longer, but I need to leave at twelve. Cause I told my friend I go out to eat with her. We can go have brunch. I haven't seen her. Um when was the last time I seen her? It's been a minute. I haven't seen her probably in a month. It been a minute. Yeah, so I haven't seen her since probably before I went to that concert in April. So, yeah, it been a month. I haven't seen her. So, we're going to go to this new restaurant called the Toasted Yolk in Biloxi. Hopefully, we can get in because it's a brunch spot. But now it's time to 10. We probably can get in because it's Cinco de Mayo, y'all. And everybody's at the Mexican restaurants early this morning. And they having a lot of day parties everywhere. So, we most likely can go eat without it being packed out, hopefully. But... Um, I'm going to come back home at the church and probably grab me an outfit. I don't know. I might change when I got church out. I don't know. We're going to see. I really don't know. But I'm just ready to go to church and get it over with. Y'all, yesterday your girl worked on a Saturday. I got to get this money. I've been applying for jobs and stuff. Rachel came supposed to text me Friday and call me. They didn't. So I'm going to assume I didn't get the job, but that's fine. Um, they just start letting us get overtime. So, I'm just trying to work on me and get some more money. But they let us work overtime this weekend. So, I was excited about that. So, yeah. But, my pictures came out so pretty. I'm going to insert my pictures, y'all. But yesterday, I had a good day of work. I basically say the whole week of work, I had a good week. It wasn't too crazy because I barely had any work. But I had a good week. Yesterday, I got out of work. I went to CB's. Um, it's a Jamaican truck, food truck. They come to school. It was so good. I had some chicken, some jerk chicken, some rice and beans and cabbage. Um, they was in front of the um, Island Freeze daiquiri and ice cream shop. I got me a daiquiri and I got me some ice cream. I was just being fat yesterday. But today, I don't really have too much on the agenda. On the agenda. I didn't have to go wash clothes or nothing like that. So... Yes, ma'am. But we're about to head to church, y'all. I see y'all later. I will let y'all know how the word went. I got my binder, y'all. So I'll let y'all know about everything. I should go get me some breakfast, but I don't think I should, but I should.
stuff from church. Church was amazing. I had got me a mocha frozen ice pop and I ate me some Doritos. I'm not going out to eat with my friend. She had to go pick up her baby out of town. So, not going on that date. So, I might go with my mama out a little later. So, y'all, today church was amazing. Like, I'm not racing now, but I have a white um pastor and he came forward how he grew up, um, how he's in a narcissistic home. He got adopted and how he just grew up in bad homes. And when he turned 17, he left. He ended up getting married at 20. Like, he just told us his life story with all he been through. And I really appreciated that. Because a lot of pastors, they're not going to tell you nothing like that. But today, would you ask for part two, dealing with anxiety? Anxiety is not malfunction of the mind. It's a signal. Find the pace of grace. Cultivate the presence of God in my life. All's well that begins well. The first 15, five minutes in the word, five minutes in the worship, five minutes in prayer. Rumination, the focused attention of the symptoms of one's distress as opposed to its solution. Let my thoughts above, let my thoughts about myself come from God's word. God wants me to give him my anxiety. God is with me. God is fighting for me. Anxiety doesn't get to win. God is greater than my anxiety. There will be peace in my life. There will be victory. And he gave us all these that I just read with a scripture. So I have to go. I got to go find me a Bible, y'all. That is my goal. I need to find a Bible because I need to go read this stuff. Like he gives you scriptures or whatever you're going through, whatever the word is during church. It's a scripture for everything that I'm reading out to y'all. Because we got to fill in the blanks. Find or renew my... Yeah, my other phone had um got real hot and it stopped recording. But church was amazing. He kept it real. They did water baptism. They recognized all the people that was graduating this year. They gifted them with things. Gave them like gift bags. And people also donated to who they wanted to donate to. Church was amazing. We did get out at Twitter today because there was a lot going on today. But church was great. I enjoyed church today. I'm so happy we talked about anxiety. They also told us to go to betterhelp.com. We get two weeks free through the church. But they help with a lot of different things. They serve on Saturday. So Saturday service, they go to nursing homes. They might set up and give way to homeless people. They do a lot of different things on Saturday. You just have to pick the group that's for you. Pick the team that's for you. If you don't like it, go to another team. They have church every Wednesday. Um, Mother's Day is Sunday, next Sunday, y'all. And he will not be preaching. His wife will be preaching. So I'm super excited about that. I'm so ready to go to church. But I have to go find me something light pink. I just feel like that's a good color to wear. No, I'm not a mother. But, you know... I'm just going to enjoy church every Sunday. But I really enjoy this church. A lot of people find I like it's not no Baptist, not no Kojic, what I'm used to. Like, for their music, is very soft. But they pray. It's, like, very teachable, very understanding, very broke down. And I love it about that church. It's very big. They had a cafe when you first walk in and get your drinks your snacks whatever you need this is like a big college class whatever you need get your snacks whatever go sit down and let's get through the word they hand you out your paper they provide you with whatever you need and i like how they did baptism today they provide them with shirts shorts they provide them with everything baptized them gave them water bags to put their wet clothes in to keep like, they really provide them with everything. So, this is a really nice church. I really enjoy church. And I'm going to keep going. And I'm going to say this. Cause today is Cinco de Mayo. A lot of people got up and went want to go straight to Cinco de Mayo. One thing about me, I'm going to praise the Lord and I'm still going to have fun too. Like I am. Because I'm probably about to get dressed. I might go out tonight. I might not. I don't know, y'all. It just depends on how I'm feeling. But I feel pretty good. Church is amazing. But I do need to run some errands. So, we're going to see. But it is so hot out this door. It's, like, really hot out here. So, we're going to see. So, y'all, I had to come home and use the restroom. I'm about to go ahead to Walmart to go get Fendi some dog food. 
and I need to look for me a Bible and then find some other little stuff. I'm on a budget, okay? Um, but church is amazing. I probably grabbed me something to eat too because I didn't um get to eat and I need to eat before I start my night. I'm just telling you that now. But yeah, I'll see y'all when I get to Walmart and get whatever I'm gonna get for this dog of mine. Okay, y'all, I went in Walmart. I've been on a hunt for a Bible and it was hard for me to find one. But I finally found one and I got y'all gotta finish some dog food. I found me a what is here? Uh, um, I think a towel. I guess that's how you see it. But it's a 26 ounce, cold for 50 hours, hot for 10 hour range, double wall, leak proof lid, easy carry hand, the great for the gym. So I work at the shipyard, y'all, and we have to have medical. If not. I that came in work with the big plastic cups. Once they drop on that metal ship, it busts. Everything busts. So, it's good to get you a metal bottle. I got a purple one, but it started leaking. So, I was like, good. I can get me a new bottle. These was in Walmart for $10. And it's $20. It's big enough. But y'all, I got a huge one. You got a straw, too. I got a huge one. Child, I hate to carry it. And I be needing somewhere to handle it's like I got to walk and carry because it's about to get real hot and we need nothing but water to hydrate, okay? But yeah, I found me a Bible in Walmart. This was $26 or something. But it's a Holy Bible, King James Virgin. It's pink. I love it. When I get home, everything I've learned for the past two weeks from this church I've been to, I'm going to go and highlight. And then I like how we got the um, it's like tabs on the side. So it'd be easier for you to find instead of just flipping through all the pages or whatever. But giant print, full size Bible. So we're gonna go and look in this today. But yeah, I'm gonna go grab me a bite to eat from Razor Canes if they open on Sunday. But I think they open. Um I might go out, I might not, y'all. I'm not sure. Um, where my mom about to go? Clocked out. They got ages 25 and up. So a lot of places they raising the age. So I might just stay home. Honestly, I might just stay home. I probably don't even go. I'm gonna just stay home and prep myself for the week and go handle what I need to handle. So and it's hot. It's, it's so hot. I don't know what to do with myself. I make about to start sweating. But let me make sure I got my card. But yeah, I'm gonna head to Raising Canes and I will see y'all. There, Pookie. I'm in the Raising Canes line. The line is long. Can I get the three finger combo? Three finger combo? What's that drink for you? A lemonade. And can I do an extra sauce? Lemonade, extra sauce, anything else for you? That's it. Alright, that's going to be 10 for 6 of that second round, too, Thank you. Yeah. I need 26 cents because who? I need them 10 back. Run that. Run me that. Much we got in here. Yeah, I should have cat. I should have went in there and cashed all these coins. I don't know what I was thinking about. I should have cashed all these. I've been holding them for the longest. I can use these to wash or something. Give me something. Instead of having to use my cash every single day. But I see y'all when I get to the house. It's running up. I gotta turn this up. I'm about to do it's currently 136. My mom probably be back around four. Um, I went and got me a highlighter, and I'm gonna start going through the Bible and reading some of the scriptures and highlighting what I need to highlight. I don't know if I'm going out or not, yeah. I'm scared. I don't know.
but it's real hot. I'm letting my phone charge. Um, we gonna let the hair down later, but I did so good on my hair. Like I'm so proud of myself. But I'm about to eat, y'all. Going and highlighting this Bible. Hope y'all enjoyed the vlog. Like and subscribe. Hit that bell. See y'all in my next video.